back to my channel, True Boy D Dice, and that acolyte, episode six. <sighs> I'm at this point. I'm ready for this series to be done, and I don't want them to renew another season. It's like this is the worst Star Wars series that we've gotten so far. Um, I think uh, Mandalorian season three, I believe, is is a little bit in that realm. Um, the Book of Boba Fett could have been better, but this is the worst. And after coming off of Soka, I was like, I was looking forward to what Star Wars was putting out because Marvel was going, you know, it's, it's been up and down. But this is the worst Star Wars series I have ever seen. And we get to where May is dressed up like Osha. Osha is with, I uh, forgot the dude's name, Sith Lord, whatever. Um, but you can tell he's like being, he's like a, a Sith knight like he's not he's not really a master but he's like a jedi knight so he's a sith knight um and he's wanting a pupil and he gets all undressed and i'm just kind of like what are we doing what are we doing you know osha's staring at him getting the water like naked and i'm just like what are, what is we have fallen so far to making star wars look like vampire diaries or twilight or something like that like i'm like what is this trying to attract the younger crowd, the appeal to the young crowd, to the I'm like, what is this? What is this? That took me all the way out. I was like, hurry up with this whole this whole episode. It was like 35 minutes long and I'm like, hurry up. This sucks. And how May is dressed up like Osha trying to kill uh Soul and then Soul and I'm like, for you to be a Jedi master, how come you're not picking up that you're about to get like trying to get assassinated, but you're I guess blinded by grief and pain and, and hurt and anger that you can't see that you're about to get killed in here. And then it, it took a minute for him to kind of recognize it. And I'm just kind of like, what are we doing? But although Oh Boy from Squid Games is carrying this whole series, um, Andela Steinberg, it's like she's playing May and Osha, but she's not really given much to work with. Like, if that makes sense. Like, I was really looking at her like, you a Jedi Knight, your sister's a Sith. Like, that would have been a lot more to work with where we get to see her, you know, use powers. But she's just a pattern one learner. And I'm like, this is boring. It's a snooze fest. This is another episode that is a snooze fest. I'm like, hurry up and be done. I can't say that enough. I'm like, I'm, I'm really over reviewing it looking at it, reacting to it, anything. I'm like, this is such a dismal series that Star Wars slash Disney has put out. And I'm like, this sucks, period. Like, this should not be out, period. I give this episode a 1.5 out of 10. Like, it's nothing that grants me, nothing to look forward to, nothing. I'm like, it, what will make this really, really good if Soul comes out and says that I am a Sith Lord and I want to tell you, I've been trying to recruit you, something up to that mag that, magna that magnitude to where he was like, he tied May up and was like, I finally get to tell you the truth. I want him to come out and be like, I'm a Sith. That is it. If, not, if that's not going to be it, then I don't care about this. Simple. So, you guys enjoyed my review of The Acolyte, episode 6. Subscribe to my channel, post a comment down below, like the video. It's your boy, D. Dyson. Peace.